Okay, so we're going to move on and take a look at the Convolution Pro, Convolution Reverb Pro. And right away you can see there's quite a few more options for us here, but let me grab this guy. Let's go with, uh, let me see, let's go with Fresh Room, see what that's got to offer. Immediately, you should know the difference. Notice the difference in what we've got to choose from. We've got a split single, early, late. We've got a ton of little presets here. Can be for drums, some air. I mean, this is just, <laughs> I've spent hours just roaming through these guys. Trust me, you can eat up some time real quick here. Uh, and then you've got your EQ effects, frequency, gain, uh, width, gain, dry, wet, and you, you can positive, mod, dampen, shape, all that fun stuff. So with the Convolution Reverb Pro, get familiar with it if you haven't tried it or you haven't pulled it out of the uh, Max for Live Essentials area and, and experimented with it because... I've got some presets and things I've made that are just mind-blowing and work really well in, in some of my projects. I find myself very infrequently actually using the built-in reverb anymore. I've gone to what I've been able to do with this guy. So I'm just going to kind of goof around with it a little bit and let you see what happens with the different settings, and, uh, and then we'll talk about some stuff here. find the EQ feature on this actually really, really intuitive and really responsive to what you're trying to sculpt or create. So, nice little touch on the EQ here. So, with the uh, position here, we can center, right, left, and really get uh, the reverb focused on a good stereo image or shape that in the you like. A little subtle modulation window for us. Some basic stuff to work with here. All still uh, great features, though, and combined with everything else that this guy has to offer. The dampen kind of allows us to basically reshape the waveform or the reverb form. along with the shape here and create some really interesting uh, dynamics and effects with your reverb.
So there you have it, the Convolution Reverb Pro and the Convolution in the previous lesson together are great tools for you to know, especially in the Max for Live uh, setting and, and within Live itself. Hope you learned something new. Let's